Hey guys, Cam here from Pocketlint, and you may remember last summer GoPro invited us to go check out a new exciting product. Of course, that turned out to be the 360 degree GoPro Fusion. But one of the most enticing and interesting features of the Fusion was this new thing called Overcapture. Essentially, it lets you move around within a 360 degree video, change the angle and the view, and make it all look like it was shot on various different cameras, moving at different times to follow action when in fact it was all just recorded at once and then you got to edit it afterwards. It's really cool. And it's finally here on mobile. We've downloaded the iPhone app and here's how you use it. The first step of using Overcapture on mobile is the same as using any other GoPro camera. Go to the camera screen, access the gallery and connect to the camera and then select the video that you want to use. From the next screen there are a few options of what you can do with the footage. For instance you could edit a 360 degree video for viewing in VR. You can also snap a photo of a frame within the video and manipulate it to look how you want. But for overcapture though your best bet is to download the file to your phone's memory. So hit that download icon and wait. Once downloaded go to the media tab in the GoPro app and find the video you just downloaded. Now you'll see a little circle icon in the toolbar. This is Overcapture. Now if you tap this, you'll get to a screen with a large white circle button on it. This then transforms into a red rounded square icon when you press it. From this point, every single movement and gesture is recorded. You can tilt the phone up and down, pan it left and right, even change your field of view by swiping on the screen, as well as pinching to zoom in or out. The important thing here though is that all of this manipulation, whatever it is, is recorded in real time and when you stop it or it gets to the end of the video it plays you the final result with all your manipulations intact. If you're not happy you can do it again and again until you've got the effect that you want. And when you're finished you can then download the finished video onto your phone and end up with something a little like this. Except where you probably do something a little bit more adventurous than walking through a forest looking for Christmas trees. So whether you've bought a Fusion already or you're planning to, I hope this video has been useful or has helped serve some sort of a purpose. I'm Cam, I'm at Cam Bunton on Twitter and Instagram. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up below, subscribe to our channel if you do like our videos and leave a comment if you want to. Check out pocketlint.com for the full written review of the Fusion. I have left that link in the description box. I'll see you again soon. <laughs>